Well, I can just laugh <laughs> as I see the scrollings in the news channels that Prakash Raj has decided to give back his national awards. I am not such a fool to give back the national awards, which has been uh, it has been given to me for my body of work, and which I am very proud of. And uh, <laughs> I just wonder why this comes. But well, coming to the point, yes, I would like to own up to certain things. And I was on a stage where I was addressing a group of youngsters and when there is a discussion about the recent killings of Gauri Lankesh or uh, Kalaburi and these sort of killings are there. And my reaction was that we don't know who has killed them because there is a police department, there is an SIT which is getting into it. But we can see who is celebrating. And I am pained, I am taken aback by the celebrations of a inhuman killing and for the very fact that I have vented out my pain and my anguish towards those people who are celebrating I've been trolled I've been used bad words on my element okay it's all in the game I take it because at least I know who or what but at the same time my question is as the first Prime Minister of this country if such people are being followed by the Prime Minister and Prime Minister is not taking a stand on them or not commenting on them. As a citizen of this country, I am disturbed, hurt, I am afraid of a silence of my Prime Minister. I am not talking about a person of some other party. I don't belong to any political party. I am a citizen of this country. And as a citizen of this country, I am not talking against any party. I am talking on to my Prime Minister and I say, your silence is chilling. I am hurt with the silence. This is what I said. And I think I have a right to say this. It's as simple as that. And this whole halla gulla of trying to <laughs> make it big by saying Prakash Raj wants to reject his national awards in protest against, this is something which I have not said. And I am not interested in continuing discussion of this. Thank you. Thank you.